When police respond to any call, they're wearing bulletproof vests. And soon, Portland firefighters will also have that option. Catherine Cook shows us why crews push for that extra layer of protection. Putting out fires, emergency medical calls, high angle rescues. Portland firefighters have always had a dangerous job. And there's something else. The first responders as they go in, um, we can become targets. Alan Fershweiler is president of the Portland Firefighters Association. He says concern among members over criminal attacks has increased in recent years. Even if you look at, at the totality of the city, it's, it's definitely become a less safe place to work for their firefighters. And, and there's no way to mix any word. It's why last week union leaders and fire management agreed that every Portland firefighter should get a ballistic vest something designed to withstand a knife attack or a bullet. You know, our chief cares about our members and, and she does not want on her watch something like that to happen. Portland Fire spokesperson Terry Foster says right now crews are getting fitted for the vests, which will be red and say medic. He says at this point it's unclear what the 200 vests will cost the city. They're also working on a policy outlining when firefighters would wear them. For us, everything's about safety. So this is just another level of safety. You never know when it's going to happen, right? In 2018, a man set fire to a home in Springfield, then began shooting at firefighters who responded. In 2019, Portland police say a man stabbed an AMR paramedic waiting at a red light during a carjacking. And then actually, I've been assaulted twice on duty, and um, it's just become more of a dangerous time for first responders throughout the country. For that reason, other cities are taking action. The Seattle Fire Department's entire on-duty staff is equipped with ballistic vests and helmets. The San Francisco Fire Department tells us they too have issued ballistic vests to dedicated units. And while Portland Fire will soon have vests, that won't mean taking on additional risk. For example, when they respond to help a shooting victim. I know that right now existing protocol mandates that Portland Fire and Rescue wait at a shooting scene until it's secure by mm -hmm. Portland Police before going in. Does introducing bulletproof vests to firefighters change that? That will not change that. Um, we, we know where our lanes are and until the police secure the scene, we will not send members in. At the end of the day, union leaders say the vests will be something firefighters will have, but hope they won't need. But unfortunately, it's another tool we'll put in the toolbox to make sure that our firefighters get home every day. Catherine Cook, KGW News.